start to the program today. So as I told you, this is going to be a very unique evening where you're going to be entertained with dance, which is going to create a mood for the actual program that is a yoga that is going to happen today, right? So uh, can someone get the standee which is there outside onto the stage? There is one standee about Sahaj Yoga. Okay. So the next part of the program is going to be a very brief explanation about Sahaj Yoga. I assure you, it is going to be just 5 to 10 minutes or 10 minutes about explanation what is this Sahaj Yoga and what is the connection with stress management. And to do that, who better than a doctor? We thought it will be most appropriate if this was, this part of the program is conducted by a doctor. So we have a renowned uh, homeopathic doctor, Dr. Alok, who has been practicing Sahaj Yoga for more than 25 years. He has treated a wide variety of complex diseases for over 20 years. He is also uh, practiced as a residing doctor at the International Sahaj Yoga Health and Research Center, which is in Belapur. Yes, there is a research center in Belapur which uses Sahaj Yoga to cure uh, complex diseases, including psychosomatic diseases. Uh, so we have Dr. Alok who is uh, practiced with them and who is currently practicing uh, both Sahaj Yoga and his homeopathic practice to come and talk to us about how the connection between Sahaj Yoga and stress management. What is Sahaj Yoga and what is the connection with stress management? Dr. Alok? So, I am going to talk to you about the program. So, I am going to talk to you about the So, thanks for coming anyway. Please come. I am going to talk to you about Six. So, you have to cortisol secret. Adrenaline rush. Wow. You say, wow. Right? And if you see a classical dance like this, I was witnessing myself. I was completely lost with, with the performance. I don't know what was your state. And the chemicals which were being secreted in my body were endorphins. And endorphins are responsible to relax you down. So when you see such a dance, which is Indian classical, everything which is coming from Indian culture produces a parasympathetic response in you. And what does parasympathetic response means? Parasympathetic response is a response in the body which relaxes you. When you work at night, when you go to sleep, 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 you are scrolling on your mobile kar rahe hote which is unfortunately a bad thing. Aapko sula kon deta hai? Who gives you that sleep? Aap kaise so jate ho? Swata hai kaise so jate ho? How do you fall into sleep? That is parasympathetic response in you, which is acting 24 hours. Aap bahut jada stress mein jate ho, bahut jada active hote ho, it will bring you down itself. So there is a mechanism going on inside our body which keeps on trying to balance ourselves. And that system is called as autonomic nervous system, which works through a response inside us, which is called as parasympathetic response. So today, with the series of events that you are going to feel today, I would rather say not watch, not see, but feel, because when I was uh, witnessing her dance, I had a feeling inside within me that was wow. That was the expression that I was carrying in my heart and in my nervous system. Wow. So when Neeraj sir was saying that how is it correlated that, that a dance is related with yoga. So we will see the meaning of yoga and we will come, uh, come to understand literally also ki how does yoga affect our nervous system and how does yoga relax us and how does yoga triggers parasympathetic response in us through which we come into balance. So, aap mein se kitne log stressed hai? how many people sitting here are stressed? Any one of you? Ek, do, teen, char, paan, chai. Saat, aat, no. Jo log nahi hai, baut achche hai. But still you will enjoy the program. We have something for you here. Stress se matlab kya hai? 
what I feel whenever I ask my patients, ki, uh, are you stressed about something? No, nee, doctor, sahab. no, no, we don't have any stress. Why do you office ka stress? Hai? I feel that stress is a, is, is a very misunderstood concept. Stress is very potent. Hota hai. I give you an example. A patient comes to me and he talks, Sir, I have a migraine. I am suffering from migraine. I have a very, very heavy headache. So I ask him, Who is your headache? Who is your headache? So first of all, he looks at me, what is this doctor asking? And then immediately he tells me, my boss. <laughs> so how? He says, that, sir, he keeps on reprimanding me, scolding me in front of my juniors every day. So this man is living in a toxic culture, toxic environment, and every day he has to face it. So gradually this stress becomes overpowering, and then uske sharir mein kuch na kuch harmful chemicals ka secretion hota hai aur fir he ends up having some physical gross level disease ye corporate level ki baat hogi office ke level ab ghar ke level ki baat karte let's talk at home you are recently married because i see some young girls here and some aunties also here you get married and you enter into an environment where there is another dynasty there somebody ruling the house and the new person enters, and there's a conflict between mother-in-law and daughter-in-law. Saas bahu ki kaani, kyunki saas bhi kabhi bahu thi. Aur har ek ghar mein kaani hoti hai. To jo bahu, ya jo saas, is cheez ko easily le ke ja sakti to she will not fall sick. Because we see every day the same case. What I want to say here is, stress is not only the thing which attacks you from outside. But your response to it matters a lot. So when you are meditating and you are having every day that parasympathetic response within you, you can handle that stress very easily. That's what this slide is saying. Stress is your body's can you go back? Stress is your body's reaction to challenge or demand. So stress to hariki life me aira. But how you take it, that matters. So today we will learn how to manage that stress.